from the observatory to the conservatory. Hi there, I'm Brian Rollins, and this is the Dorky, Geeky, Nerdy Trivia Podcast. This week we're covering the fine arts. It's a broad category that covers painting, sculpting, architecture, literature, and music. Future episodes will dive deeper into each section, but for now, we're just doing an overview. As always, we'll have three rounds of 10 questions each. I'll give you the question, then a short timer, then I'll read the answer. Simple and fun, right? If you need rules on scoring, you can visit dorkygeekynerdy.com slash rules. Books open, and let's begin. The Dorky Round Number one, what artist famously opined, in the future, everyone will be world famous for 15 minutes? Andy Warhol. Number two, the Italian word piano translates into what in English? Soft. Number three, what architect pioneered the Prairie School movement? Frank Lloyd Wright. Number four. Leonardo, Donatello, Raphael, and Michelangelo, aka the Ninja Turtles, were all artists from what period? The Italian Renaissance. Number five. While a flourishing industry today, what Japanese art form had been largely banned in 1787? Manga Number 6. Often attached to mosques, what is the name for the tall towers that are used for a call to prayer and act as a visual focal point. Minarets. The tall spires typically have conical or onion-shaped tops. Number 7. While the English horn is a woodwind, the French horn is part of what instrument group? It's a brass instrument. Number eight. In art, what is the term for the area around and between the subjects of an image? Negative space. Number nine. What Victorian poet wrote... How do I love thee? Let me count the ways. Elizabeth Browning Number 10. Born in 1924, what writer was famous for the novella Breakfast at Tiffany's and the novel In Cold Blood? Truman Capote The Geeky Round Number 1. What American abstract expressionist called his work, quote, motion made visible memories arrested in space, end quote. Jackson Pollock Number two, what art movement 
named for a work by Claude Monet, is characterized by relatively thin, small, yet visible brush strokes, open composition, and an emphasis on accurate depiction of light. Impressionism Number 3. The art of decorating initials, margins, and illustrations in manuscripts is known as what? Illumination Number 4. Weighing 13,271 kilograms and named Emmanuel, this musical instrument is the largest in what group? The Bells of Notre Dame. It rings an F sharp. The smallest, Jean-Marie, weighs 782 kilograms and rings an A sharp. Number 5. Frédéric Auguste Bartholdi is best known for what sculpture? Liberty Enlightening the World, or more commonly known as the Statue of Liberty. Number 6. In Japanese, what is sometimes translated as the art of singing and dancing, and is known for its elaborate makeup. Kabuki. It dates back to 1603. Number 7. What poet wrote, resist much, obey little? Walt Whitman. Number 8. What is the name of a scale using only five notes? A pentatonic scale. Number 9. When I do count the clock that tells the time, is an example of what type of metric line? Iambic pentameter. Number 10. Carved by the Rapa Nui people, what is the name of the monolithic human statues on Easter Island? Moai. The Nerdy Round. Number 1. Encompassing architecture, music, painting, and sculpture, what 17th and 18th century art style derives its name from the Portuguese word for flawed pearl? Baroque. Number 2. What is the term for an individual piece used to create a mosaic? A tessera. Number 3. What is the name for a piece of art, usually a panel painting, that is divided into three parts? A triptych. Number 4. What dolls, made by the Hopi and Zunai tribes, were made to represent masked impersonators and dancers? (laughs) 
Kachina dolls. Number 5. What large artwork was stolen by Nazi Germany in 1942 from St. Bavo's Cathedral in Belgium? The Ghent Altarpiece. It was the focal point of the book and the movie The Monuments Men. Number 6. Johann Sebastian Bach's brother, Jakob, was known for playing what double reed woodwind instrument? The oboe. Number 7. In 1982, King Juan Carlos of Spain bestowed the title of Marquis on what artist? Salvador Dali. Number 8. Winning a Nobel Prize in Literature in 1946, which author wrote the novels Siddhartha and The Glass Bead Game? Hermann Hesse. Number 9. What composer had his first work, The Old Cat and the Young Mouse, published in 1920? Aaron Copeland. Number 10. Louise Bogan was the first woman to hold what position that is currently held by Tracy K. Smith. U.S. Poet Laureate And that's the bell class. I hope you had fun. Like I said before, we'll be coming back to these individual topics later on in the show. Speaking of which, here's next week's clue. Which science fiction series, which launched in 1993, was famous for the tagline, The Truth is Out There? Our book of the week is Leonardo da Vinci, A Life from Beginning to End. Da Vinci was a painter, sculptor, inventor, and so much more. Be sure to read all about his life and his works. You can find a link to this and other books of the week over at dorkygeekynerdy.com slash book. By getting this book and any of the others, you help keep the mic on and the show going. Speaking of keeping the show going, be sure to rate us on the podcast directory of your choice. It really helps spread the word. I'm your host, Brian Rollins. Thanks for listening. <laughs>